Hello and welcome to Royal Vibes. Reverend denies Emin's speech on racism at Prince William and Kate amid Royal Race Row. The Prince and Princess of Wales are in Boston to attend the Edgehold Award ceremony. So guys, before we get right into the full story, please do ensure to subscribe if you haven't. Turn on the post bell notification to always stay notified whenever I post a new video. Consider liking the video and please watch right up to the very end. Reverend Mariama Whiteheimon, who recently gave a speech on racism in Boston, claimed that her words were not aimed at royal family, a news report has stated. The Reverend confirmed that she did not know about the scandal before giving a speech, page6.com revealed. When asked if she meant to slide the Prince and Princess of Wales, she said, As a person of African descent, I often begin anything I say with a, with a land acknowledgement I want to bless this space and acknowledge the beauty and the painful history the media told me afterward. According to Mail Online, Reverend Mariama Y. Heyman, the city's chief of environment, energy and open space, gave a, a, a strong worded speech just minutes before the Prince and Princess of Wales took on the stage at Boston. The news report suggested the Reverend Heyman who founded a youth organization focused on teaching the history of the civic rights movement, said, On this day, I invite us all to consider the legacy of colonialism and racism, the ways it has impacted people across the world and its connection, its deep connection to the degradation of land and our planet that we are seeking to reverse, the stories lost, the species made extinct, but also the persistence of people in the face of oppression and the fundamental dignity of all our, of our relations. Her speech came hours after William's godmother, Lady Susan Hussey, apologized and resigned after she repeatedly asked a black British charity board where she was really from. The Reverend started her speech by acknowledging the ancestral lands we stand on today as she went on to express gratitude to the Prince and Princess of Wales for opting to host this year's Edshot Prize in Boston. She said, Now you all know we are a city of many firsts. We are honored to be the first American city and the first city outside of the United Kingdom to host the Edshot Prize. Ngozi Fulani, a charity founder, was questioned about her background at a charity event at the Palace on Tuesday. Ms. Fulani said she was totally stunned by Prince William's godmother's comments. The palace described the remarks as unacceptable and deeply regrettable. This is the first of the US since 2014. So guys, with that, we have come to an end of this episode. Thanks a lot for watching. Until next time, bye-bye.